this video, I'll show you what a segmented bar chart is and how it compares to ordinary and stacked bar charts and how to make a segmented bar chart in Excel. I have three charts here, all showing comparisons for the same set of data. We have three different categories of sports and which sports boys and girls prefer. The graph on the left is an ordinary bar chart. Bar charts represent comparisons among categories using horizontal or vertical bars. A bar chart has two axes. One of them shows a discrete value, in other words, a set of numbers, while the other one compares the values with different bars in different categories. The stacked bar chart in the centre is used for grouping or categorising the parts of a whole. The bars in this chart are categorised into stacking order to represent different values. One axis will show the discrete values, the numbers, and the other one will give the variable bars in a stacking order. Different colours show distinctive parts of the whole bar. A segmented bar chart is a kind of stacked bar chart. However, each bar shows 100% of the discrete value. Segmented bar charts, unlike the stacked bar chart, represents 100% on each of the bars Otherwise, it's just a regular stacked bar chart. A quick note though, some people do not make this distinction. They might call a stacked bar chart a segmented bar chart and vice versa. So be careful if you're asked to make a segmented bar graph. Make sure you know what your instructor or teacher is asking for. Let's take a look at how to make a segmented bar chart in Excel. The first step is to type your data into Excel, like this example. We have two different categories going on. We have the category names for the things we're comparing, in this case different types of sports, and I've put that in the first column. In the first row is my second set of categories, that's boys and girls. In each cell is the number of boys or girls who preferred a certain sport. For example, 15 girls preferred volleyball. Now we can insert our graph. Click the Insert tab. Click the down arrow next to the Insert column or bar chart icon. This first option gives you a simple bar graph. The second option, a stacked bar graph. We want this third option. Excel calls this a 100% stacked column. And here's our segmented bar chart. If you want to change the title of your graph, click the title and type a new name. I'm going to call this Type of Sports Preferred. I hope you found the video helpful. Please take a moment to subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you in the next video.